Amanda just got a brand new camera, and she's gone to the park to learn how to use it. Flowers are a terrific subject for photographs. Hold on a second. Did you check your focus? The lens on your camera focuses down to two and a half feet, so you'll have to move back a little. Wait, did you set your f-stop? What's the speed of your film? ASA 25 and bright sunlight. What's your shutter speed? 1 25th of a second, eh? In that case, set your f-stop to 8. You know what would be nice for this photograph? shallow depth of field. It just means that the area of focus is shallow. The background will be out of focus, making the subject really stand out. To get shallow depth of field, you need to have a very large aperture. That's the right idea, but you've got it backwards. A large aperture means a small f-stop. On your camera, the widest aperture is f4.5. Now remember, with a wider aperture, you have to increase the shutter speed or you'll overexpose the picture. In bright sunlight, 1 200th of a second should be perfect. Well, hold it once again. You're in the shade now. Your f-stop is good, but in this shade, you'll need about a 30th of a second. Wait again. You can't shoot that handheld at a 30th of a second. You just can't hold the camera still enough. You'll need a tripod. Just one more thing. Well, at that exposure, the background that's in the sun will be overexposed. If you use a fill flash, it'll help the picture look better. You know what's another way to make that photo even better? But, but, but wait. W wait, miss? But, uh, miss? You could take another photograph? But I thought you wanted to take pictures. I am. <laughs>